Yeah, don't suppose there's any other weapon laying around. Just a health kit there. God, this music makes this this whole situation seem so intense, and yet half the time is just spent wandering around waiting to, for this guy to actually be somewhere. Is there a weapon I can grab around here? Because this thing is going to break after a few hits. And if this guy tanked five shotgun shells, it, he's not likely to... Oh, there we go. Maybe the steam pipe might be a better choice because it's faster, but... I blocked that. Alright, guess it's time to heal. You know what? I'm going to take advantage of the fact that I'm playing this on PC. I'm going to save. And do the same for the final battle because I am not wasting my time doing things over and over again. Come on, fellow, where are you? What I also don't understand is why the taser's gone now. Like, it's not like Thomas threw it away or anything. Where'd it go? Finally. Thanks, asshole. Leland. Nephew, please listen to me. I am here to help. You are not yourself. You are not in your right mind. Let me help you. I know of what I speak. I... Yay, 100% completion on this level, with five achievement rewards. Bronze Bird, Silver Bird, Propaganda Reports, wherever the hell I found that. Gold Detective Badge and the Chapter 9 Completion Award. Fantastic. Well, let's see if we can finish this game in this session. Hopefully without any more 50s radio announcer voice. Actually, I'd say this is more like 30s radio announcer. But that's fine. I'm rambling on just to extenuate the uh, game. Welcome to consciousness, my friend. Though you won't enjoy it long. <sighs> we were good in the beginning. But you turned out to be kind of a failure, didn't you? <laughs> you still don't get it? I've been using you, Ethan Thomas. <laughs> I watched you, and followed you, and used you to find the serial killers you so desperately sought, and then killed them. Okay, I must admit, I was a bit dramatic. Killed them the same way they'd killed their own victims. <laughs> a bit of fun, you know. <laughs> I got good at it. Shame it ruined you at the Bureau. But some things are unavoidable. Of course, since you're no longer going to be any help, there's no reason to go on this way. How would you prefer to die? I didn't like the torturer's methods much. Too risky. Perhaps a slit across the throat, like the roadside carver. Ah, short and sweet. Or maybe the bone cutter. Neatly dissected the body, removed the internal organs, and labeled them for the police to find. Oh, yes, he was one of mine, too. Oh, he was so close to him. But I got there first. <laughs> Perhaps it would be better if you lost a finger. Quickly! Find and destroy it. It has caused all this madness. Go, kill it now. I'll try. 
Yeah, better follow this linear path that the fire's building out for me. Um, climb through. Thank you. And a convenient bird. Don't know if I'll be 100%ing this level. Again, not really cared enough about it to this point. And who is this us? Stay tuned for the sequel to find out the answer. Is that the grass just kind of grown through the floor there? Hmm. I also don't really understand where the flashlight is suddenly gone. I mean, it makes a cool little uh, effect where you have to choose between having a gun and a light. Kind of Doom 3 style, not steel. But... At the same time, it's just you know, another one of those strange things that never gets explained. Well, I guess it's not this way then. It'd be extremely hard to figure out where to go from here because it's just so damn dark. I suppose I could cheese it and turn up the brightness, but where's the fun in that? Now, inexplicably, we've got crazy large men. Believe it or not, that was pretty much my uh, tactic for the entirety of my first playthrough of this game. Just run up, smash him, run back, rinse and repeat. Kind of bland. Just do another saver here. Uh, what did I just do? It's a bird. Where there's like a movement prompt on this, and it doesn't seem to have actually done anything. Again, it popped up so quickly and I hit the button so quickly I don't really know for sure what it meant. What it read. Huh. So that would explain, that would explain why I've never gotten 100% of the birds for this level. Never noticed, noticed one there. Very small window of area I can see here. It's pretty obvious, but. Alright, here comes the fun part. Well, one of many. Just an absolute spam of enemies that start popping up in this area. Alright, now the big guy. Hmm. Oh no, I don't suppose I can just run away from this. It's one of the little ones, just kind of spins around to see the action. Block that. Come on, come on. God, these enemies are so fucking tanky. Just takes so damn long to kill. It's ridiculous. I don't really think I want to save after that fight. 
at this health level. Okay, just invisible wall around nothing, because why not? Linearity, why not? Invisible wall here, they should have just left the fence unbroken, because then it would at least make a little bit of sense. I don't know why you'd want to jump down. Maybe there's a bird or something there. I guess that would be a possibility for why you know, that prompt is there. Did I not press this thing already? Seems to be a little bit of HDR going on here. Oh, brilliant. I mean, it seems a lot easier to see in the dark now with the uh, torch away. I didn't think this engine had it in it. Well, not the HDR effects like that. Then again, it could be faked. Okay, so it was nothing but a shortcut down here. Something I may have actually taken before, I just don't remember it. So, where could there possibly be birds around here? Whatever, it's not that important. Oh yeah, this looks safe. But don't really see why they would even give that option. Like, who's going to choose that over a torch that allows them to see? Okay, you know what, never mind. You go on, you go have your fun. Be a distraction. Oh. Yeah, that's perfect. Perfect. Move, move, move. There we go. Give myself a bit more space to move. Now he, now the little one can be a distraction. We go tactics in work. That only work until convenient linearity pops in. Jesus fucking Christ! Tarted as shit. You are dead. Saving checkpoint. Well, that certainly could have gone better. I'm probably, I'm probably just gonna cut out the uh, failed attempts. You know, that last one was pretty much just that. All right, so fantastically, no health pickups for a while. I'm pretty sure right around here is where another one of those crazy things with the uh, metal piece. Oh, two health kits. Okay. So things aren't as dire as I thought. Yeah, one of those crazy fuckers is going to pop up. Thankfully, we got this here for no reason. Okay, are we done with the Zerg rush? That'd be nice. Welcome to the party, friend. Shame I don't have a sledgehammer to make this more fun. Woo! 
funny. I, I seem to be doing a lot better against these guys than I am against the uh, slow tanks. Okay, gotta wait a little bit for the HDR like effect to kick in so I can actually see. Now to double check, this is better than that, right? It's a little slower and doesn't reach as far, but. Oh, uh, wait a minute. It's worse in every way to a flaming piece of wood. Why did I even bother? Dropping it, that is. Do a quick look around. Never know, there might be some more birds around here. Now just a rock. Eh, I don't really care about those things that much anyway. I can probably just look it up on YouTube. You know, the... You know, the uh, extra things that I haven't unlocked yet. Here's more tanky McTank person. Two of them to deal with. All right, get some infighting going on. Man, I blocked that. But you two have fun. Beat the shit out of each other. Hoping to hit, I was hoping my attack would have hit a little sooner. All right, I've not been blocked off meaninglessly from the uh, health, right? Right? So that would really make my, make my day. All right, we got three of them here, but I want to backtrack to the uh, furthest one just so when I have to backtrack for more health, they won't have to go as far. Alright, I'll just leave those other three there. No need to waste one of them on this little bit of tiny little shred of health that it needs restoring. Of course, contrary to what I've said before, I'm gonna keep looking around a little bit for the birds and metal pieces. You know, I probably at this point just walked past all of them. Yeah, good enough. Ah, uh, terrifying. But hey, at least the music's gone. You can call it that. We're looking at five rounds left. Let's just have a quick look at what's left in these other weapons. Alright, good. Good, 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 good. Repetitive as always. Let's just make sure those... Uh, what am I trying to say? Basically, I'll be making some return trips back there every time I need a new weapon. Which will be often. Alright, it seems to take three shots to kill one of these things. I thought this thing had five shots total. I shot three of the first guy. How did it, I was able to shoot three at the second. Alright, time to do a little backtracking. Come on, this is not the time for your crappy movement. Right, right, right. Time to run. Run. Rather not have to fight these guys with this thing. Yeah, 
I suppose I could have conserved the ammunition a little bit better. Find the other ones. What are we looking at here? One left. No point. Let's grab the one. Suddenly, 11 rounds. Don't know how I got an extra bit of extra bullet in there, but hey, I'm not complaining. I'm just confused. <laughs> 